Indiana 22. Um, I am starting here at Griffin, Indiana. It's a new mod map. Um, not new to the game though, apparently. I've, this is, as if you've watched any of my other Let's Plays, this is the first time I've ever played Farming Simulator. I know that there are very avid players, 19, 17, 15, um, and this has made a comeback. Um, so I've just switched to our farm. Quite a nice setup actually. There's a few things missing that we do need. Firstly, let me show you what we get as a new farmer. We get field number 35, which has soybeans in, which is a fantastic start. We have this whole plot here. Um, grassland, looks like a bit of woodland here and here, which could be extremely useful. Um, then all of this section here, this is the farm area, and then you've got some roads with the grassland around it. On the farm itself, we have here a um, workshop with a John Deere and a weight given to us. Up here we've got a pickup and your sleep trigger with the farmhouse. Then we've got a tiny little shed with a John Deere. Everything looks a bit beaten and battered, which I, I really like that. It's like we've taken over this farm. Maybe we bought it, we went into bankruptcy and we've purchased the farm. We're ready to go. That will be our storyline. We've got the farm of 400, um, nice, nice silo in great condition. We've been given a fermenter to start off with, which is awesome. Um, we have this barn here um, with the storage underneath. And we have another shed here with a harvester and a header, a cultivator and a seeder. And in the middle, just randomly, there is the trailer as well. So there's a few things that I do need to get started. Um, I'm going to need a fertilizer because a uh, sprayer um, because the soybeans. I've I've already been up to have a look at the soybeans. They do need fertilizing. That is, they're at zero percent. Uh, let me take you up there now. Thankfully, even though everything looks a bit beaten and battered, everything has already been fixed for you and they're all fueled up. So, I'm quite happy about that. I normally don't look for traffic, so I'm, tr I'm going to try to be good. <laughs> right, here we go. So, here are our soybeans. This is a lovely size field. See, 0%. What I haven't done yet, I haven't actually sorted out my settings. So let's go down and have a look at what I think we should have. So five, yet yeah, that's absolutely fine. I'm going to change economic difficulty to normal. Traffic on, seasonal growth off, one day per month is fine. Snow off, um, crop disruption off. Periodic ploughing required on, fieldstone on, lime on, weeds, I'm going to turn them off for now, um, just while I get started. Uh, let's have a peek, I want all of these off, no, do you know what, let's do on, let's do normal fuel usage, let's do on for for weeds let's go all in um dirt normal engine start on start stop yeah that's all fine i want all of these off then let's go over here um i think i'll keep all the triggers on and uh, i'm happy with all of those vehicle volume yeah that's fine so we've gone for seasonal off but we've put everything else on and we've gone for normal um, economic difficulty okay so let's have a peek 
to see if we get lucky. Is there a cedar in here? No. Front loader, there's a tractor, header, and an auger wagon. All things I do not need. Okay, so let's go for the cheapest fertilizer spreader available. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna buy it. Now, because I'm new to this map, I actually don't know where the shop is, so I'm gonna have a very quick peek. Let's have a p look. Um, is that... There. Okay, so go past these big fields. Oh, that's quite a journey. Alright, let's go. So we can have a little tour while we're here, shall we? Um, it's quite hard to see the road on this little map, but... So I've, been, I've watched a couple of other YouTubers who have played this particular map before in the previous uh, games, and they've said it's apt. This is phenomenal. Um, the way it looks, the way it feels... Apparently it's spot on. So I thought I'm going to make this my new home for a little bit. Give it a try. It feels very... I've been playing the Western Wilds for a while, so it didn't feel like a home. So I'm hoping that this is going to like feel like a home. Let's have a look. We're going in the right direction, aren't we? Yeah, okay, good. Well, I've never actually been to Indiana. I've been to a good few um, places in America, but Indiana is one I'm yet to, to get to. So if you've been there, I would love to hear your comments and what you think of it. The place I go to most is actually in Florida, um, just south of Orlando. My husband's auntie lives out there. Um, so we're lucky enough to get to go out there once or twice a year and go and visit and go and enjoy a bit of downtime and uh, we always have a great time. I just love the food and I love all the different sports they have out there as well. I know we've, we have a lot of football and rugby. They, they really get into their sports and I do like that. Right, now I'm going to need to look at the map to see which one it is. I am, as I say, I'm new to this map, so please forgive me for not knowing where I am or what I'm doing. Okay, if this is the motor place, normally that is the location you pick up. Oh, there she is. There's our new Fermento. There's our new Sprayer. Okay, while I'm here, let's buy some fertilizer. Okay, there we go. This normally takes two or three bags worth, this one. Lovely jubbly. All right, let's go. So I was reviewing my um, YouTube analytics and I'm actually getting 30% of my audience is from America. Uh, so I would love you to comment, let me know where you're watching from. 
or where you're watching from, sorry. So I've been to only a few states. So I've um, I've been to Colorado, uh, Denver. Spent a quite a lot of time down in Texas, mainly Houston, uh, Galveston, that sort of area, all for work. And of course, Orlando every year for the last good few years. Um, and then, like most people, I've been to New York City, which I absolutely adore. I just love the hustle and the bustle. Um, and because I, I actually live quite close, I live in between London and Oxford. So it's quite a familiar, familiar feeling when I'm in um, New York, although it's like London on steroids. So yeah, tell me where you're from. Let's let's get a round robin of my my regulars. I know I've only got a few subscribers at the moment, um, but I am seeing people coming back. So if you if you if you do like my channel, please subscribe so you you'll get notified when I put up a new video. I haven't actually done that many videos this week. I've been really really busy with work. Uh, I know there's been lots of new mod maps and there's been lots of new um, mods in themselves and what I'm actually going to do at some point is show you one of them which has come out and I'm quite impressed by it um, and again it's all about uh, I, I normally do videos on how to's um, and one of my ones is how to get fertilizer or how to make fertilizer or how to make seeds and things like this well let me show you something I'm gonna let that go off and do its thing we have got a new um, and I think it might be under silos I haven't actually gone to look at it or place it yet let me see if it's in here. I'll recognize it when it comes up. I'm assuming it's in silos rather than production. Hmm, maybe not. Um, silo extension maybe? Sure, surely it's not going to be in, no. Let me just check containers. Okay, it's in containers. Alright, so these are brand new. This is field, field work fill station mod. Now, there is here a little bit of a cheat. Um, <laughs> like back there, I actually purchased my fertilizer, um, and of course it's 1,900 and something the bag. To fill that little thing is like 246, 6,000. Now there are two mods in this particular pack, field work fill station. Now this one here provides you 25% discount for buying bulk. This one here, it's free. Load up all your implements for your contracting gigs for free. It's crazy. So it's kind of like a no-brainer. Why wouldn't I put that down? I feel bad though. I feel like it is cheating. But what, So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do the 25% discount one. Rather than going to the shop all the time to go fill up my bits, um... I'm going to opt to place one of these, it's 15 grand, so it'll take a while for me to make my money back anyway. 25% discount, there is the free one though, if you do want it, but I'm going to go for the 25% discount. 
I actually do like making my own um, fertilizer and things, so this does go with my gameplay. So while my AI worker is doing that, let's have a peek and see if there are any contracts. Let's have a look. Okay, so we've got a spraying contract. So that's herbicide. Um, I mean, yeah, that could be a good one. That's a big contract as well, isn't it? That could be worth it. I think let's accept this one first. Let's borrow the items. Uh, does that new... Oh, yeah, I, I do want to come and have a look at you. Just have a look. Does this have herbicide in as well? I'm assuming it does. Let's just go quickly look again. So it was in containers. It's just this field workstation. I don't really want to bring that over and not be able to get herbicide, if that makes sense. So I think I'm going to just buy the herbicide from here. Let's go here. Right, how much is one going to fill up? I'm assuming this is a big old tank. Do you know what? I didn't even look where the field was. Field 6. Oh, it's a bit of a distance. Okay. 47%. We're definitely going to need another one then, aren't we? Okay. Oops. My brain. Here we go. Okay, let's go. I have to be honest, I haven't actually used one of these yet. Where you actually drive the sprayer. Um, so I'm quite quite excited for this one. Uh, can I get out that way? Let's go. So we're going to field six. I've got my guy at the farm fertilizing away and we have that potential harvesting contract and we do have the qu equipment for that as well so that whoop, oh goodness I want to damage the equipment um, that could be quite a good one to do as well what was it that we had to harvest um, oat See, there is also a new, like, trick where when you've got contracts, you can go and pick up the straw swath. So I might be able to. I just need to remember what piece of kit that you need for that. That might be something I could do. and Start collecting all of the kit for... Um... for having animals. I like to have cows if I can. This is a very big field isn't it people? Hey, okay, let's unfold the sprayer. Oh wow. <laughs> wow I didn't expect it to be that wide. Okay let's reposition myself. Nice. Okay, let's do this. Fold spray so we don't need to lower it. Change work width. No, I'm happy with the work width. Let's go. Oh, this is fast. 16 miles an hour. Holy moly. Well, that's impressive, isn't it? 
just going to put the, a worker to this so we can have a look. The piece of kit. How much are these to buy? I'm, I'm intrigued now. I'm assuming it's in vehicles. So it's obviously crop protection. Is that it? That's it, isn't it? Bruin? Bert Hand? Yeah, that's it. So 259,000. So you put herbicide and liquid fertilizer in there. That's pretty cool. Yeah, I've, ne I've never used this before. Um, so this is actually quite a treat. And it goes so fast. So that's 10% of this contract done already, you see. So let's leave him to do that. He seems like he's having a good time. Um, let's have a peek to see... This is my field, and you haven't really done a very good job here, have you? Have you run... Did he run out? Sometimes these AI workers just say they, they don't they don't always cut the mustard. See normally if you go to hire one you can tell where they've missed. They wouldn't start working if it hadn't been done, if that makes sense. So he's saying he's completed this contract. That's not been fertilised. And then that has, but this hasn't. Okay, I'm just going to do this last bit. Move over a little bit as well. So the other thing I'm going to need is a mower. Um, or a mowing set of some sort so I've got so much meadow grass to cut that I can make silage and that's a good money earner that would be a really good win so that could be something that we can look at doing um, ooh, let's get off here. Let's take this back up. Actually, I might fill this up and just see how that new container works. And then I can have a quick look through to see whether it has herbicide. Oh, it's just going to be intelligent and pick up what it needs. Yeah, see, that was quite significantly cheap. That wasn't even a bag's price worth. That's very good. Okay, we like that. We like that a lot. Um, I'm a bit concerned that he's decided to stop working. Has he got caught by a, by a tree? It's quite a nice relaxing job anyway. Beautiful sunflowers in the heart of Indiana. How relaxing. This is one big field. This is going to make a lot of money for someone. See, with the new, there's a new production chain where you can make vegetable fat. So if you make sunflower oil, put that into the production chain and you can make sunflower um, vegetable fat. And 
it sells for quite a bit of money. It's it is worth it. I'm wondering here is I'm gonna to need to go and get some more herbicide aren't I yeah this field is nowhere near done very cool though all right let's have a think about this so do we want to take on a harvesting contract why not let's do it um, now, I'm wondering if I can think of what that, I don't even know if I've got it installed actually. It's like a, um, it acts like a forage, a forage harvester. It looks like that, but you attach it to, um, you attach it to a, a tractor. Just wondering if there is maybe it'd be under grassland, grass care. No, mowers. No. Okay. What I'm probably gonna do is I'm going to come out of this um, recording and I'm going to go look for the bit of kit that I'm looking for because then we can pick up the straw and make some money from the straw before completing the contract. Before that you weren't able to go and pick things up you see. And it, it, this is kind of like a nice new trick. Winter equipment's definitely not in there. I may have not even downloaded it, you know. Let me um, let me see you soon. I'll go and download the bit of kit I need, and I'll be right back. And I am back. I'm at field one where my contract is. And just so that I didn't look like a complete fool, I did check it worked beforehand, and it did. Um, so when I read about this particular piece of kit, it was telling the truth. So for example, on this contract, all I need to do is harvest the oats and take them to HH milling. That's all I need to do. The straw is, is a free game. Now normally you can't pick up the straw with a forage wagon, but with this, it is letting you. Let me tell you what this is. So this mod here is the Lizard Forage Pickup. Um, it's 65,000. I actually just leased it to make sure I did pick up the right one. Um, you attach it and put a trailer on the back. Pop it in. Um, and then you just turn turn the forage wagon on. And you chase the uh, chase the harvester around, and it's a bit freaked out because it's you're not really supposed to be doing this on contract fields, so it kind of doesn't know. You see, it's a little buggy. It's like glitching, Westworld style glitching, um, but it works. It actually does work. I'm so excited by this because now I'm going to pick up all this extra straw so we can win the money on the contract and 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 get a load of straw. The only thing is this trailer is diddy, baby diddy. It's already full. Um, and it folds in beautifully as well. So I am now going to have to take this back. I'm going to need to consider getting another trailer. Otherwise, this is going to take me forever. 
is not. Mm. The other thing, not only so I need to put some more herbicide in the sprayer. My guy has uh, has run out of herbicide. Let's see how long it's going to take me to run to and from. But to be that is full, and I haven't even done one stretch yet. Um, there has been a new uh, trailer that's come out, and it's got unreal capacity, and I mean completely unreal. Yeah, it's this one here, XL, and it's got two hundred thousand liters. I'm all over. I'm all about this. Do you know what I'm gonna do? It. I'm gonna lease it. Do I want silage additive? No. Let's add it. Because what's the worst that can happen? I actually love the bright green. Red colour, let's go for a dark colour. That looks awesome. I'm going to have to lease it though because I don't have the money. Um, so let's go and drop this off at the farm. I won't sell this trailer. Maybe I will. I'll keep it for now. You never know when you might need it. For eight and a half thousand litres, I'm just never going to get round to anything. I know 200,000 would never realistically fit in. I'm going to scoot up here. We're all neighbours here. Oh, actually, my wagon does not like that. Oh, I'm sorry. Sorry, I'm driving on your crops. Um, yeah, I know that's a lot of uh, <laughs> 200,000, but I'm going to need it. I'm going to need it, guys. I've come up an awful way, haven't I? I'm going to have to do a dodgy here. I'm going to have to drive through there. Am I going to be able to get through there? Let's risk it. Nope. Can't get through that. Oh, what have I done? Why have I come this way? My farm's just over there, that's why. Let's go in. Let's go in here and dodge the trees. Ooh. Oh, we did it, we did it, we did it, we did it, we did it. Okay. So this is the forestry land that we could purchase. It's right next to our farm. Of course, I would drive into the one sign that there is. Oh, we're struggling to get up here, aren't we? Oh, come on, come on, come on, go, 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 go. Yes. All right. I wonder if this silo will hold this straw. You gonna take it? No. Okay. Um. So I need to buy. I need to buy something else then, don't I? multi-fruit silo maybe they're always good to have um, that's a multi-fruit with a barn that's quite nice although it doesn't really fit with the look and feel does it if I get the red one of these That's kind of in theme, right? Do we feel that looks in theme? Uh, 
Let's do that then. Do you know what? I'm not. I haven't got much money left, so I'm going to. I'm going to sell that. Sell that silo. I'll landscape that another time. Right, let's tip this out. You are going to take it as well, aren't you? Please tell me you'll take it. You're kidding me. These normally take hair, uh, sure. What is going on? Come on. Oh, I'm such a fool. I didn't even have the tool highlighted. Oh, it's been a long week, guys. I'm tired. <laughs> there we go. Well, at least we... I suppose selling the farmer, at least we've got a little bit of extra cash. Um... Just going to. Can I fit that in there? It's a bit of a stretch, isn't it? As I say, I've stored the trailer in there. Um, let's go pick up our new trailer. I need to sort out the herbicide. So I've got a few. I've got a few bits to do. I'm. I am enjoying this so far, actually. It, it feels like... Um, it definitely feels very homely. It feels like a place I can really get stuck into and have a good time. Everything's quite far away, of course. I've, where I've been playing on my Western Worlds, I've kept everything very, like, compact. So I've uh, actually got to work for it this time. Which is a good thing, makes it more realistic. didn't realise this forage wagon actually has capacity as well. You see down there, 500 litres. It's interesting. I didn't know it did that. Come in through, everyone! So I took my uh, dogs out for a run this morning. They went out with two of their doggy friends. Um... And they are absolutely shattered, which I am loving. They are just completely passed out on the sofa. They're running around and chasing. Um... Oh, now you decide to bark. Run around chasing balls and having a great time, won't you girls? So I'll probably end up doing these contracts off camera. Get the harvesting contract done, finish off the herbicide contract. Um, get ahead a little bit. I don't really know where I'm going with this Let's Play. I think it's just about having some fun. Wow, this is huge. Yeah, this little tractor's going to struggle pulling this thing. Ooh, can I get past you? Yes!
actually now thinking about this, this is a forage wagon rather than a trailer. Mm, um, am I going to be able to pipe in? Let's find out. Am I going to be able to pipe in anything into here? Oh, have I just made a mistake? Let's get the pipe out. Let's just have a look. Let's do here. Turn on. Lower it. Oh, okay, hang on. Right, no, 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 no. See, a traditional wagon says you can't, you don't have access to this land. Now if I turn this on... Oh, it's working, look. It's glitching like mad, but it's working. I feel so bad. Feels like I'm a cheat. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. I need to come and grab, um, grab the oats. What is the capacity of that? Uh, that's eight and a half liters. So that's why we have an eight and a half liter trailer. The other thing is, I don't actually have another tractor. Uh, let's. Was there one on sale? There was. Right, let's get you then. Ooh, if I had some more money, I would definitely get you. Um, okay, I've got 19,000. I definitely need a bigger trailer for the stuff that I'm doing. Let's have a look. Mm. It's only eighteen and a half. It's still diddy, isn't it? It's forty. Forty seven. I normally go for the yeah, the underbelly. That has the unreal capacity of a hundred and ten thousand litres. I could just lease one of those, couldn't I? I'll just do a sing, uh, single dual tank. Let's do single. No. Let's do the dual. Let's do none. This is a little bit big for what I've got at the moment. That's what I'm thinking. I'm going a bit too greedy too fast. See, that's got two. I could always do more trips, couldn't I? See, that doesn't hold what I need it to. 45,000. Let's start there, shall we? We don't need manure spreader, we just need it standard. Let's lease that. Then at least we've got something with a decent capacity, so I don't need to do bucket loads of runs. Um, but it is a little bit more realistic. I managed to get a good deal with this tractor. I'm happy with that. that. Coming through! Yeah, I feel good about this purchase. Well, lease I should say. What a nice map. 
I like that it's flat as well. I I'm I know the hilly ones are beautiful, um, but when it comes to placeables, it's much easier when when it's flat. Sometimes easy isn't always good. All right, let's go pick this up. Let's get some more herbicide. And then I will um, give you a break from my voice. Is that going to go under there okay? Oh, just. Whew. Okay. So we'll leave him to do that. Right, we need to have a look at where we are. So it's one and a bit, really, isn't it? Let's fold you in. How do I get to the shops? I need to go out and right. I'll just get one more of herbicide. I'm going to do a little dodgy, go through here. Go on someone else's farm, of course. Sorry, everybody. That looks like potatoes. Griffin, I love that. It's nice attention to detail all over this map. Right, where is the shop again? Um, mm -mm. Should be over there somewhere, right? Still a lot of learning. Yes, it is over here. Okay, good. Good, 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 good. Right, let's fill her up. Let's get her back on the job. Let's cash in some dosh. Big pallets. One will do us, I reckon. Still 2,400, isn't it? But it was a sizable contract, so we spent two, four, six, six, seven, two, seven thousand two hundred, and I think the contract's worth. Um, was the contract worth twenty three, something like that? We borrowed the equipment as well. Sorry, farmer, skipping across your beautifully ready to harvest stuff. So if I go up here and down one more, I reckon we'll be good. Let's unfold. Oh, I do like this. I do like this a lot. Too bad that I want one now. I'm going to have to harvest a lot more fields to get one of these. That's what everyone's thinking. But it's so quick. 60 miles an hour. 36 metre width. Yeah, I mean, that's awesome. When you've got these big fields, it's like the only way to do it, right? That's 83% complete. That does worry me ever so slightly. That maybe the AI worker might have missed something. And I'm not going to be able to see where it is, am I? But let's have a look. Let's do this strip and back up again. Because that's roughly where he would have finished.
93%, okay. Keep your fingers crossed everyone, by the time I get to the end of here, if it's not 100%, I'm going to have to do a lot of guesswork. Okay, it's not finished. How far? Ninety-seven. Oh no. Okay, I'm going to hazard a guess that a lot of the issues will be by the trees. So let's go fertilize around the tree area. don't really want to go and get any more fertilizer either or herbicide sorry okay let's do this We did it. Woohoo! Contract complete. Let's cash in. That was a good contract. Very happy about that. Um, and I suppose I'm going to leave you there, guys. I'm going to keep going with my hack. It does not like it at all, does it? I wonder if the game is going to, or if this is going to get fixed anytime soon, so we can't do this. Um, but yeah, it is quite cool that we can turn on the straw swath and get some extra goodies. So if I get the silage done, I could t I could also um, so mow the grass, make some hay get some silage, and then I'll have enough for toast and expression. Which would be absolutely amazing if I can make toast and expression without having to um, bale or grow any oats or barley, because I'm doing it all like this. What a win. It's going to take hours, though. I mean... This is a big field. It's a big monster field. But, I tell you what, they'll be worth it. Because we'll have a good few, good few hundred thousand litres worth of straw from this. Um, we'll have 40 odd thousand, is it 43,000? In hard cash. For doing the job itself. Which is what more can you ask for really um and yeah we'll be on track to to get in our animals so that's what i'll leave you um i'll be hard at work on this um field and when i have finished i'll come back and yeah i hope to see you soon have a good one <laughs>